This video shows you how to access the shared folder in IBM Planning Analytics. To perform some of the steps in this video, you need to connect to the Planning Analytics remote desktop. If you don't know how to do this, you can watch the video Accessing the IBM Planning Analytics remote desktop. There are three ways to connect to your shared folder. First, by using Windows File Explorer in a remote desktop session to manage files that already reside in the shared folder. Second, by running a secure FTP application on your own computer to move files between your computer and the shared folder. And third, by using File Explorer to move files between the shared folders in other Planning Analytics environments. Let's look at the first method, accessing the shared folder using Windows File Explorer in a remote desktop session. First, connect to the Planning Analytics remote desktop, then click the folder icon to open an Explorer window. You can see the local C drive, however, you cannot see the shared folder. To connect to the shared folder, in the address bar, type backslash backslash data backslash s. Notice that the contents of the shared folder appear in the right pane. I want to be able to go back and forth between the shared folder and files on the remote desktop without having to re-enter the folder address. So I'm going to map the shared folder to the remote desktop. In the address bar, click Data. The S folder appears in the right pane. Right-click the S folder and select Map Network Drive. Select a drive and click Finish. Notice that the shared folder now appears in the left navigation pane. You are now ready to move files between the remote desktop C drive and the shared folder. Now I'm going to show you the second way to connect to the shared folder. That is by running a secure FTP application on your own computer to move files between your computer and the shared folder. For this demo, I'm going to use IBM's personal communications FTP client. First, I'm going to enable SSL security so that the connection is secure. From the Communications menu, I select Configuration. Then I select the SSL tab, and then the Enable Security checkbox. Now I'm ready to transfer a file to the shared folder. I have a CSV file in my local TM1 installation named Scorecards Financial Revised.csv. I want to send the file to the corresponding location on the remote desktop TM1 installation. To make the connection, I will need the username and password to access the shared folder. I can get this information from the Planning Analytics Administrator or from the Welcome Kit. I can also find the host address of the shared folder from the Welcome Kit. In the Personal Communications Client, I enter the host address, username and password that I just looked up and then click connect. Now I navigate to the file on my computer that I want to transfer. And select the target folder on the remote desktop. Making sure that my source file is selected, from the Actions menu, I select Send Files to Host. You can see that the file now appears in the target pane of the FTP client. The third method of accessing the shared folder is by using File Explorer to move files between the shared folders of separate Planning Analytics environments. All you have to do is look up the IP address listed in your welcome kit and then enter it in the Explorer address bar of your shared folder.